Your, your path cannot be but remarkable. Your parents were uneducated. Your father was a truck driver. And your mom sold tea by the roadside. Yes. And the two had moved to Kenya to start a new life together. Yes. So you were born there in 1972 in a displacement camp. The family was, however, deported in 1989 to Mogadishu. You've been living in Finland since 1990. You did not learn to read and write until the age of 14 years. But now she's holding three master's degrees, among which one from Harvard, and is currently working on her PhD in women's governmental participation and empowerment in post-conflict regions. What a life. How proud are you of this path? I am not proud. I am blessed. I am privileged. Um, there's a, there's a, uh, a difference. And... Uh, I was able to do what I am doing because of a mother who greatly believed that I could become whomever or whatever I wanted to become in life. Not proud, blessed, and, you know, happy to be where I am today. How much do you believe what you came across, what you have witnessed, has nurtured this willpower within you? Everything that I've had to go through in life, and my life has been a very hard one. I did not come from a rich family. I did not come from a privileged family. I did not come from an established family. I came from a very poor, disadvantaged family. I have faced hunger. I have faced physical violence, I still have the scars on my body, I have faced deprivation, all kinds of things that are unthinkable, but I am not bitter, because those things made me who I am today, they made me the strong woman that I am, and everything that happens in life happens for a reason, and what has happened in my life paved the way for where I am and you know, for where I am going. So yes, that life became the wings upon which I am now flying.